Many philosophers believe that everything in geometry is a right angle triangle. One vector two vector three vector four vector five vector six this point and this point this is two two this is one thirty this is two forty uh, today I'm gonna uh, prove that I'm gonna give you something and we're gonna convert that to a right angle triangle to solve the problem for example for example let's consider this problem uh, let's consider this problem a man walks oh, let's think. yeah a man walks uh, 100 meter to east and then 300 meter to south well you have to put a vector because this is vector addition so to 300 meter to the south and then 150 meter to One hundred fifty meters, one hundred fifty meter to um, to southwest, and finally two hundred meter and then finally two hundred meter to the two hundred. Uh, meter to northwest okay so this is the problem so 100 300 150 and 200 okay so this is 60 degree uh, this is less 30 degree and let's say this is 60 degree okay so now let's convert this one to a right angle triangle okay so first what are we going to do vector um, a a x a y and then b b x b y and then c c x C Y and then D D X D Y. Okay, so let's uh, start with A. So hundred cosine zero, which is uh, hundred hundred sine zero, which is zero three hundred cosine nine, uh, not ninety two seventy. Okay. So you measure the angle like this. So why this is 270? So you, you bring it over here. Uh, well, let's put it over here. You bring this vector over here, all right? Maybe I put it over here. You bring this vector over here. So this is 270. Okay. All right, so 270. Okay. So 270 and then uh, 300. Sine two seventy, and then finally uh, you have one fifty. Again, um, just to let you know why this is now thirty. This is thirty plus one hundred eighty, so two hundred ten. Uh, so one fifty cosine two hundred ten, one fifty sine two hundred ten. This is. 200 cosine uh, this is definitely not uh, 60 this is 180 minus 60 so this is 120 200 sine 120 all right so let's see let's use the calculator um, 200 sine 120, 200 
sine 120 and that is 173 200 cosine 120 and that is negative 100 and then this is 150 sine 210 this is negative 75 150 cosine 200 and that is negative 130 300 cosine 270 0 300 cosine uh, 270 0 300 sine 270 negative 300 okay great so now oh, we're gonna uh, separate them with respect to their angles so what does that mean this one has a zero degree this one has zero degree this one has zero degree this one has zero degree we're gonna prove why they have the zero degree we're gonna add up all the zero degrees and we're gonna call them x all right so how much is that that's 100 and 100 cancel and this is um, negative 130 okay now these all are these all are these all are um, 90 degree right okay or 270 degree whatever it is uh, and we're gonna add them up so now 0 minus 300 minus 75 plus 173 is negative 202 okay great so we're gonna draw X and we're gonna draw Y okay and um, we're gonna draw the resultant we're gonna draw X and we're gonna draw Y and then we're gonna draw resultant so this is the resultant let's use red for the resultant uh, so this is the resultant okay and as you see uh, the other thing I'm gonna show prove that you have this is uh, 1 comma 0 this is 0 comma 1 this is negative 1 comma 0 this is 0 comma negative 1 this is plus plus this is minus plus this is minus minus this is plus minus uh, what do you see over here is uh, that the proof of that one the first quadrant plus 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 uh, uh, the 270 degree in this one uh, positive and negative positive and negative the third quadrant is negative 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 the second quadrant is negative positive negative positive okay great all right so uh, what is the this one this one exactly this one see uh there <laughs> Yeah, it's magic. So this is called displacement. And how can we find it? Well, negative 130 squared plus negative 202 squared. So 130 squared plus 202 squared. And that gives you 240. And that gives you 240. This one is 240 meters. So this one is this one is 240 meters. And what is the angle of this one? The angle of this one is uh, tangent y y is negative 202 divided by negative 130. And that is 57. So, but remember, uh, don't just this is 57. But this that is not 57. That is 57 plus 180. Okay, so one 180 plus 57, and that is 237. So this one is 237. Why is that? Because if you put it over here, this one would be. 180 plus 57 and so 237 so this one is 237 
Okay, now let's do something uh, even more important. Let's see how much time we have. Okay, I think we can do it. So this is 100. So let's draw a vector 100. It's too long, so we're going to make it smaller. This is the vector. Vector A has only one vector. Vector B has only one vector, 300. So this is three times as big. All right, so this one has to be smaller, okay? All right, so this is three times as big. So this one has to be a little smaller. If this is 100, this is three times the 100. Okay, that's the B. C has two vectors. All right, this is 130, so this has to be a little bit bigger than this one. 130 and what quadrant is this one quadrant 3 so 130 is this bigger than this okay 100 130 yes 75 is a little smaller than this one okay all right so this is uh, negative 100 uh, so this is exactly gonna be like that right So exactly the same size. I'm going to do it again. Okay. And then this one is um, double. So this one going to be is the half than that one. More than half. More than half. Okay. Good. So now our goal is to create a right angle triangle using these six vectors. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, let's see if we can do it. Um, let's use the different color than that. Let's use yellow. Okay. All right. All right, so. Okay, so far so good. So we have the 100, 100, uh, and this one. Okay, great. Okay. And then, I'm going to remove this one. And then we have this, and then this, and then this. Okay, so we have to now draw two point to draw the resultant. And this is our resultant. What is our resultant? And this one would be, we have uh, this one would be how much? Uh, we have 100 minus 100, 100 minus 100, they cancel. So this one is one negative 130. Okay, so then this one has to be what? Two forty. So this one is two forty meter. Okay. And this is uh, one eighty. And this one is, I think, uh, this is. Let me see. Two or two divided by fifty-seven plus one eighty. This is two thirty-seven. So the angle is 237. Okay. All right. So you're going to see it slow motion. Let's see it. Okay. 